What's going on YouTube? My name is FG3000. I'm back in the place to be and welcome back to Epic Summoners. In today's video, we're going to be doing a daily overview, giving you guys an idea what it's like to play Epic Summoners on a day-to-day -day basis. So let's go ahead and take it from the top. Ladies and gentlemen, here are the dailies in question. Um, so let's go for the Adventure Gate Rewards. Um, that way, just in case you guys have never seen Epic Summoners or Idle Heroes in action, um, this will show you what combat is all about. So I'll go ahead and grab my rewards. Of course, this is an idle game, ladies and gentlemen. So um, your characters will offline idle, get tons and tons of experience, gear, etc., etc. You come back six, eight, maybe even 12 hours later, and you come and reap the spoils. So there you have it. Now, of course, as you guys know, um, this game is very much inspired by idle uh, heroes. Uh, is that the name of the game, Idle Heroes? I'm pretty sure it is. Um, very much inspired by almost it's almost an exact copy like if you take a quick glance at this game And you didn't know what it was you would absolutely say it's that other game um, However, I will say that the game is a little bit different when it comes to the art style um, Some of the quality of life is slightly better in this game, but through and through it's pretty much that So there we go. That was combat. That was the very first thing to do use honor rewards to gain a goal. I will one of those things that, of course, they want to drain out the diamonds out of the out of the economy as much as they possibly can. So we'll do that. Send out five hearts. I don't even know if I have five friends. I do. I got six. <laughs> Very nice. Boom. Um, wish two times in the wishing pond. All right. So it's one of these things. So um, you definitely, when it comes to these, you definitely want to save up until you get eight. Because if you spend eight, you get ten spins. If you do it one at a time, you do it one at a time. Oh, come on. VIP two. <laughs> I can't even do it. <laughs> I gotta be VIP to spin it all at once. How rude. So as a free-to-play player, you basically get screwed out of two of these every single time you roll it 10 times. Or you just don't do it, and you just kind of wait until one day you actually top up and then spin them all. But, I mean, if you do that, then you're screwed again because you never get to do your daily. So it's all it's all messed up, I tell you. Welcome to the pub, ladies and gentlemen. You know what this is. You ready? You're tried and true! Dispatch mode, ladies and gentlemen. Has a nice little quality of life feature there. So all you gotta do is hit smart. It'll find the element type, star type, all of that in question, and then boom, you are on your way. I definitely appreciate that, and thank you for not hiding that behind VIP. Then of course, speed those up because those are very short, and boom, there you have it. Complete two pub quests, done. Forge three equipment. So this is gonna be one of those games where you can take low end gear. Gear is never really wasted in this game because all of the low end gear can then be basically transmuted up or forged up to higher tier gear as well. So very simple. All you gotta do, make note of the little uh, red dots there. Boom, boom, very easy. And as you guys can see, I just forged this gear right here, which is a one star purple ax. Then I turned around and used that same ax over here to make a two star one here. And then look at this, I can make this two star into a one star spear, but I think I'm gonna slow down now. I'm gonna slow my roll a little bit. There you go, forge three equipments, done. Complete one basic summon, heroic summon. Let's save that to the very end. Let's go jump into the arena, ladies and gentlemen. I am down. Let's get it on. Uh, look at this guy, level 39. Come on. <laughs> I've been, I've been slightly playing this game for about a week or so. Come on, you can't beat me. Look at this cool Minotaur, though. That's pretty cool. Like I said, I think the graphics are better in this game versus the uh, Idle Heroes game. Like, the sprites are just bigger, more vibrant, more colorful. But they are definitely inspired by Idle Heroes, for sure. I'll flip that over. Can I get all of them? Nah, you got me. <laughs> Ooh, Itachi, 21. Welcome, buddy. I get that reference. All right, let us, you're low boy. I don't even see this guy's level. So I think because there's no level, ooh, skip fight. Hold on, let's go and see if we can actually skip the fight without VIP. VIP or level 80, so it is a soft VIP when it comes to that. So once you get level 80, you will be able to skip those. Um, and like I said, I played the game not really playing, just kind of logging in and grabbing my resources. Um, I was able to get where I am today um, in about a week or so. So if you were actually playing, I would say in a week, you could probably hit level 80. Here's a really high tier guy that's just gonna destroy us, but I wanted to see some cooler looking characters. Like I said, I like the fact that the sprites are bigger and meatier. So very nice. All right. So that completes our arena fun here. What, oh, we're, what is this uh, challenge tablet? Let's go over there and check this out. 
Oh, this is your uh, daily resource grinds here. So let's uh, move on up to this 80k one. Can I skip this fight? Once again, VIP 80 is required. Let's see if I can go all the way up here. This is basically your daily resource grind to get gold. This is going to be a little bit more challenging. This game does, of course, have the elemental system when it comes to um, if you have one element type, like this one right here is element human. So they're actually going to have plus HP, armor, and crit. Um, this is the thing that lots of idle games have basically taken wholesale from idle heroes and incorporated in lots of other different idle games, which I actually kind of like and don't like at the same time. I feel like sometimes it can stifle um, your uh, creativity on what type of teams you want to make. But at the same time, I get it. I understand. What team is this? Oh, you guys have no aura whatsoever, just like me. All of these characters that you see right here are just characters that I got. Um, just via for free, just logging in, using my free summons, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, you can actually use two of the same types of characters on one team, which I actually don't like. Um, I don't like it from like a just a visual standpoint, like not even from balance or anything like that. Nothing like real tangible or anything like that. I just don't like it from a visual standpoint where someone can just have a team of Wu Kongs or something. Like I just I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't like it. <laughs> Wait a minute. I got to win two battles. I just got spanked on that one. So hold on. I got to make sure we actually complete our dailies here. Too many videos, ladies and gentlemen, where I don't actually complete the dailies. Can't have that. Our homegirl over here sitting side saddle. Very nice. And little three, like, you know, I mean, it's high. I don't like it, though. There you go. That is that. Ladies and gentlemen, Brave Challenge is complete. Claim done. All right, so let's go over to our summoning. So we have a, a few free summons here waiting on us. Um, okay, a one-star skeleton. Thank you for nothing. <laughs> and a four-star. Uh, I wanted to see what his element type is because I don't actually recognize the uh, this right here. How many times are you going to click FG? Two more times. Three. All right. <laughs> so that is that. Um, and this is your friendship summon here. So pretty straightforward there. I have a three star. I think that's human. I think that's, no, it's probably, I don't know. <laughs> but let us, I have 17 of the heroic summons. You gotta be VIP. Upgrade VIP level to expand the number of hero backpacks. Ah, come on. <laughs> oh, goodness. Let me see my hero backpack. Where is it? Where's my hero backpack? Let's take a look here. Hero. 39 out of 45. I will spend the 200 gems to get a, a measly five more slots. And it keeps going up for the same amount of five more measly slots. Come on. I tell you, all these games always being so freaking miserly. Word bingo. So miserly when it comes to backspace and hero space. Um, we got another one of those four star dragons there. Nothing too crazy. Um, now I'm going to be out of space, which is just like kind of annoying, actually. Um, if I want to buy more keys, Hello. I think I need to go to the grocery store here. I can buy one of these golden keys here, one of these silver keys here. Do, 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 do. Let's do our free refresh. There's another silver key, another golden key. That's an arena ticket, which I don't care about. From that point on, it'll cost me gems to continue on. I don't actually believe um, that you can just like just buy keys like willy nilly. Got my 200 gems back, so I will buy some more uh, space real quick. I don't think you can actually buy g uh, keys willy-nilly. Like, they have to be in the store. I've seen certain games do that, where you can't just be like, you know what, I'm going to buy 500 keys right now. You have to actually kind of buy them gradually through the stores. But let's let's double check that. It's just the welfare for VIP and whatnot. Um, there's lots of events going on. They just actually just updated as well. So you can buy keys with cash flat out. Like, this right here will get you 20 do, 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 do. Got a fusion, fusion event going on. Daily mail reward. Yeah, I think uh, I'm pretty sure you can't do that. There's some more right there. If you buy them in that VIP, there's some more keys there. There's my login bonuses. What is this? Is this a two year anniversary? Wow. Look at that. This game has been out for two years, ladies and gentlemen. And if you log in, you're going to get these little epic summoning tickets here, which will allow you to trade them in for goodies. Look at that. Anniversary video as well. Daily resource or daily daily overview as well as anniversary video. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to summon one more time. Oh, I don't have 10. But this time it doesn't matter. 
Randomly selected one or ten. Three to five star hero. Oh, here we go. A freaking A in this bag nonsense. You know what I'm about to do? You know what I'm about to do right now, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls? Watch, watch me now. Watch me now. <laughs> we're, we're about to handle this. Well, we're not going to go to the expedition right here. Here it is. There we go. We are about to handle this. Get these freaking one star heroes out of here. Disassemble. And these two stars. Disassemble. You know what? I'm feeling myself. And these three stars. Forget these three stars. You're gone, son. <laughs> Give me, like, literally no resources. That's, like, a pitiful amount of resources here. Like, that's, like, nothing. But maybe those other things are actually worth something. All right, all right. Back over here. Now, flip it to diamonds. There you go. Way to pay attention, FG. I figured it out at the end. I figured it out. Look at this. I got a five-star version of this guy right here. Assassin. Naga. Speaking of Nagas, today is a World of Warcraft Classic Day. So, shout out to all the people that are going to be playing World of Warcraft, World of Warcraft Cla Classic. <laughs> Probably playing shamans and, and things of that nature. Maybe even dwarves. Alcohol Destroyer. That's pretty cool. What else is here? Nothing else there. Let's keep going. Backpack again? Ay, Dios mio. Where's, where's this thing at? One more time. No one stars. No two stars. Take, get rid of these three stars again. Just, just to make room. I'm a four-star man myself. Get rid of all these things, just for the sake of this video, really. I'm not sure if this is the right thing to do. If I were you, I wouldn't do it. I wouldn't follow anything that FG does in a video. Let me, let me tell you something. <laughs> Let's see. Nothing really cool here. This is like kind of cool. Little rogue knight. There you go. And then I have seven more of these tickets. So what I can do, buy one. Oh, I can't just buy the thing. Let's go, let's go for broke. Little skeleton dude there. And then finish out these keys. Might get something awesome, who knows? Three star, four star, little healer. Done and done. All right, so now I have this new and improved team, ladies and gentlemen. So now what I can do, I can go over here to the next stage Hit battle. Let me see. So here are all the different element types right here. There's element. There's dark. Human. Saint. This game has a ton. Barbarian. Dungeon. Rainbow. Okay. Rare. Okay, hold on. Look at this. Three dungeon heroes and three barbarian heroes. So these are like the... Uh, like here's rainbow. So just one of each it looks like. Element dark is element and dark mixed together. Element human, obviously. Element saint. Dark Human, Dark Saint. So this is what um, Mobile Legends Adventure was doing for a while, but they got rid of this because they felt like that was even more limiting. So I wonder if I have any like full team of like one element type. Let me see. I got a bunch of... Hold on. Maybe I do. Maybe I actually have... I just hate using two of the same people. It just It just bothers me. I have no rational reason to be worried about that but there it is look at that activated the element type boom i don't know why i'm going into this fight because all of these characters are level one <laughs> so don't do that um but i will show you look at this little cute orc with a little flower on his hair there you go but i will show you um a quick look at the upgrade system in the game it's pretty easy this is not going to be one of those games where if you get a character um you're going to be able to get it online pretty quickly so let's just say for example um, who is, how about, how about this guy? He's five star. So if I want to level him up, pretty easy to do. I can do one, one key to equip all the gear in question. And then when I'm ready to level him up, I can just, I could, I could, can't hold it down. <laughs> can I, are you sure? I can't hold it down. Can't hold it down. <laughs> I tried, man. I tried twice. <laughs> I was like, no way. Yes way. So this is all the currency that you get when you're just idling. The green stuff is EXP juice. The gold is obviously gold. Here we are, we max leveled. And then once we need to tear up, we'll use this currency right here. Let's tear bad boy up. We got ourselves a new skill activated. And there you go. Pretty straightforward. Nothing too crazy, but I like the fact that when it comes to idle games, it's usually kind of easy to get that character online rather quickly. Um, so that's one of the pros of playing an idle game. There you have it. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, 
once again. My name is FG3000. This was a look at Epic Summoners, a little daily overview. What are you doing now, FG? Just showing you some other content here. Look at these. Look at this. Shout out once again to World of Warcraft Classic here. Got some of these really awesome night elves and their uh, weapon, the glaives, the war glaives, ladies and gentlemen. Shout out to Illidan. Who knew there was going to be so many um, call outs to World of Warcraft in this video? Not me. Not me. Very nice. This little dragon island is basically just like, you know, you just keep continuing on. It's like an endless tower mode, but they're different islands. And as you guys can see, it goes on and on and on and on. Got some fog of war there, so they can kind of hide the rest of it for you. Um, what else is in here? Challenge tab, but that was a daily resource grind. Of course, guilds. Um, I showed you the arena. Don't have this unlocked just yet, but in two levels, ladies and gentlemen, I'm almost there. That's going to unlock. There's the dragon island that I just showed you. The wishing pond is the um, little uh, uh, roulette wheel here that you have to be VIP to really take advantage of. Um, but no, you can't even have soft VIP. Like some of them, some of the VIP say you have to be this level or this VIP. In order to get VIP two to do this wheel, you have to just get old fashioned, pay money for it. The adventure gate is the campaign. I showed you the summons. The forge is where you make stuff. Altars where you disassemble heroes because you don't have enough backspace. You have the tried and true. Not really tried and true yet. I guess we can make anything tried and true if we say it enough. Um, the expedition mode right over here, um, pretty straightforward. You're just on a, a nice little journey, trying to get to the very last node, getting yourself treasure chests along the way. Pretty straightforward, we've definitely seen that before. The grocery store where you can buy things. Um, fuse Quartz, this is where you can actually fuse together different creatures here, ladies and gentlemen. What is this all about? Why is, why is it showing red? Let's see. Ah, oh, there's no smart button for this one, come on. <laughs> Let's see what we get out of this thing. I'm just gonna just throw all kinds of stuff in there. Who cares? 10, let's see what happens. Look at this, I got this guy and a bunch of gear that got unequipped from the characters that I just ate. There you go. Nice little way to get yourself some uh, some characters there. Um, I do like games when they have these fuse systems because it's a really good way to kind of get, to kind of avoid the RNG of the gacha. You can kind of, you have two ways of getting characters, right? The RNG gods or the fuse RNG gods, one or the other. But this gives us a really good, look at this uh, Death Maw. I think that's the guy's name from Cataclysm. There you go, look at this. So here are where all the cool characters are. Dragon dude, little Scorpion dude, little Hydra dude, little Ragnaros dude, little Hydra dude, little uh, 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 Molten Core wolf dude, little Tree dude, <laughs> little Torn dude, Orc dude, Nagas, dragons, and uh, the Naga Queen who uh, was just downed just recently. Maybe recently, like a week ago. There you go, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. I don't even know what I was doing in this video, but I hope you enjoyed. My name is FG3000. See you guys in the next video. Later.